OCS, Officer Candidate School, for many is a life changer. It is a step into a larger world where the responsibility and rewards of leadership become part of the fabric of your character. My name is Ensign Gary Smedley of uh, the U.S. Coast Guard. Since making that transition from being enlisted to an officer, I've had so much more responsibility placed on me that I did, did not have before. OCS is open to both civilian and enlisted members of the Coast Guard. An E3 with a degree can apply for a reserve commission, and an E5 with four or more years of active duty service and 30 college credits can apply for a temporary commission. I'm Ensign Tracy Lippincott, and currently I am serving at Maritime Safety and Security Team Boston. As a leader at my unit right now, it's important that I train with my team, that they know that I'm capable of doing the same mission that they're doing, uh, that I'm sacrificing exactly what they're sacrificing. OCS is 17 weeks of intensive training honing the skills necessary to lead Coast Guard personnel, to execute special projects, manage budgets, to perform the duties and responsibilities of an officer in an ever-changing environment. I'm Ensign Thomas Bardenwerper, and I'm stationed on the Coast Guard Cutter Reliance out of Portsmouth, New Hampshire. One of the unique aspects of Coast Guard OCS is that you become operational very quickly. Within a year of joining the Coast Guard, the crew would help me get qualified to pilot the cutter and carry out law enforcement boardings. For any given OCS class, there are four assignment opportunities. Operations Assure Response. This career track typically involves a rotation between law enforcement, search and rescue, pollution response, and operations within the command center. Operations Assure Prevention. In this career field, marine safety professionals conduct vessel inspections and investigations while enforcing international laws and regulations on the high seas. Operations Afloat. Deck officers learn navigation and piloting. Engineering training focuses on propulsion and machinery. Life at sea also includes opportunity for weapons and communications officers, and perhaps a path to the captain's chair. Operations Aviation requires even more training as you head off to flight school and train to become a Coast Guard pilot. Candidates who successfully complete OCS are commissioned as O-1 ensigns in the United States Coast Guard, with both the ability and the expectation to lead enlisted members in the execution of Coast Guard missions. In being an officer, you should embrace and accept challenges to take on more responsibility. This is why OCS is an opportunity for born, proven leaders. Individuals who not only like to take charge, but who welcome the challenges and responsibilities that come with leadership. Having graduated from Officer Candidate School, my future is wide open. If you've got the experience and the drive to become an officer in the United States Coast Guard, if you were born ready, visit GoCoastGuard.com to learn more about the program requirements and to discover the extensive career opportunities available.